Won't you please be seated? The darkness of our shame and sin separates us from one another and obscures our view of God's mercy and love. But this is not God's will for us. For God desires that we live in unity with one another as good stewards of God's creation and witnesses to the help we have in the one who created us, redeems us, and sustains us. Let us come now with humility, sure of God's forgiving grace and reconciling power as we confess our sins and seek the way of Christ. Let us pray. Gracious and merciful God, with heads bowed by the weight of our sin, we have come before you, seeking your love, mercy, and hope. Lift our eyes from our petty concerns, from our self-doubt and selfish habits, to see the glory of each dawning day, the faces of neighbors in need, the help of your never slumbering spirit. Forgive us, Lord. Make us confident of the song you have given us to sing, attentive to the gifts and needs of neighbors, and responsive to your guiding hand, so that we might join a heavenly harmony directed by the outpouring of your mighty and merciful love. Embraced by the love of God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, we pray. Amen. Friends, hear this good news. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, we have peace with God and with one another, so that by his grace we might stand as a chorus of witnesses to the hope we have in God. Know, know that your sins have been forgiven, and sing, sing your simple and beautiful song. Amen. Amen. 